happens, you go into the uh, template selector here. You can see when you click on more templates, I have a shit ton of templates saved. My custom templates are here. And these are the Milanote, uh, you know, templates below. But you can see, like, I have all of these different templates that I've created over the years. And, you know, I use these for uh, context dependent downloads, digital courses, etc. Let's go back. Let's search for Uh, brainstorming. All right. So here are the uh, templates that are available for brainstorming, uh, you know, sort of, uh, you know, a, a document that's structured to have a brainstorming sort of element. Uh, and again, the really nice thing about all this is you're going to get this pretty much done like a document that's actually structured for you that you can then, you know, add your own content as you're about to see. So let's look at this one here. For folks who are actually in my uh, community, you'll notice that this is how a lot of the stuff that you've probably downloaded from me looks like. And there's a reason for that, because I'm using oftentimes Milanote uh, templates to create the content that I invariably, you know, offer as products. All right. So let's zoom out a little bit. Actually, you know what? I'm not sure I love, I'm going to use this one for, for the time being. This is an important step. You want to keep the example content. And this is going to actually copy the template with all these pieces in place. So really all you're doing here is, you know, creating a new document around something that you're teaching, right? That is, um, you know, obviously related to you and not what this is here. So, um, you know, essentially just replacing the images. You get the point. I'm not going to do this for this whole document here. But this is where, um, you know, I think Milanote really stands out because it gives you the ability to embed content within an interactive uh, board or PDF, right? So as you can see here, this is a video that you can download either on this board, which makes for a great sort of community uh, canvas for conversation, comments, et cetera, uh, for you know your clients if you want to offer it like that. And or you can also uh, offer this as a PDF that you can um, you know, embed all the audio, video content that you choose. You can add, the, add additional PDFs, et cetera. Uh, there's just lots and lots of cool things that you can do. So for an example, let's say, um, I'm gonna find a video that I've recently added. So let's, um, uh, I don't know, let's look. All right, so let's take this one here. This is a mindfulness video off my YouTube channel that I recorded a while ago. And I'm going to actually paste the link here. All right. So there you have a video that I've added. And you can move it around as, as so. Now, the other thing that you can really do, which is very cool also, is you can add like audio like this from Spotify or, or SoundCloud. So if you have a podcast or you've recorded private audio, uh, let's say using a private podcasting app and you know, using, you know, publishing it elsewhere, you can add uh, either via a link or you can actually upload, you know, like your own videos, right? So let's go and let's find the... Here's a video I recorded earlier today on WordPress versus Ghost. 
and it's going to take a minute, you know, to load. So that's less than optimal for doing a video like this, but we're going to delete that there. And when this loads, we're going to move this here. So now you have 